What's up, YouTube? This is Mike with Oz Reptiles. So this is uh, weekly vlog two. Uh, if you haven't checked out my first one, definitely check it out. It's a new little thing I'm trying to do, a weekly, vo uh, weekly vlog. Um, part of this vlog, I'm going to be showing off some of the clutches that are starting to shed out. And if you pan down real quick, this here is the Fire Woma Mom. And you'll see why I'm showing her to you in a second. She's not happy right now. Here. Whoops, sorry, little. <laughs> but, um... This is mom, she's a fire woma, and again, I'll explain to you why I'm showing her to you in a second. Let me put her away since she's not very happy. Um, and it's funny, her daughter, who I'm about to show you, is just like her in attitude. Now her daughter, this is a daughter from last year, and again, I'll tell you why I'm showing you all these things in a second. I think that her daughter is a pastel woma, but check that girl out. Now, why I showed you mom and this girl from last year, this is actually a pastel woman that's possible head clown, uh, is because when I'm identifying what I think I got in this clutch, I can definitely use people's help, but I'll also kind of explain why I think what I think based off what mom and this older sister from last year look like. Now, before I pull the clutch out, I just want to give a big shout out to Roland Woods. Uh, Roland uh, is one of my first Patreon supporters, um, and so I just wanted to give a big shout, a big thank you for those of you that, that uh, have followed me. My Patreon is basically set up for people that buy off me and people that follow me, uh, just giving you even better deals. If you bought from me before, you know I give all return customers 10%, but if you are a Patreon supporter, you get even better deals than, than the 10% um, that I give to returning customers. Sorry. A Fire Woma female bred to a GHI Lesser Chocolate. 100% head albino male. So all of these babies are 50% pos head albino. But uh, I will start with uh, the little feisty one right here. So this girl here, or this one, I shouldn't say I haven't sexed them yet. This snake here, I, <laughs> I'm actually not sure what it is. I think that it is a fire, no. Actually, tell me what you guys think it is. <laughs> um, I'm not really sure. It's not, it looks like it has Woma and Lesser, so maybe it's a Lesser Woma. But then, if that's a Lesser Woma, this one here, I guess, would be a Fire Lesser Woma. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe we have Lesser Woma, Fire Lesser Woma. All right. This next one here is awesome. I actually thought it was a fire GHI at first, but I was looking on Morph Market, and I'm pretty sure that this is a GHI Woma, which is really awesome. Whoops, sorry. This girl here is looking to tag me from below. <laughs> so, uh, sorry, GHI Woma, I think. Whoop, see, don't bite me. All right, then we have what I think here is just a normal I guess it could be a possible chocolate sorry let me get all these guys back in don't bite me <laughs> oh she's biting each other you go over there oh all right now what's left this one actually hasn't shed yet but this is a GHI lesser pretty sure that's all that's in there but that could be no, I think it's a GHI Lesser. And then finally we have a really nice GHI. Now, I think this is just the GHI, but it's super dark, so there could be something else in there. Um, and just for the sake of this, let me show you. Uh, this is a clutch from earlier in the year. Now this I'm thinking is a GHI possible chocolate. 100% head albino. But look how much darker this one is. Sorry, this one looks like they're all going to tag me. So I think that this is either just a regular GHI or maybe there's something else going on in this one too. So this is, I think, my last ovulation of the year. Um, this is a crystal female, and she was bred to a pinstripe clown and a banana clown. So I'm going to get everything 100% het clown and special Mojave banana, special Mojave... Uh, pinstripes, you know, something cool like that. There's a little future in that in this project here. But this, I think, is going to be my last clutch and last ovulation of the 2018 year. Hey guys, so the weekly vlog 
obviously is going to be over the week, so there'll be different days. And uh, I showed you the rest of this guy's clutch earlier in the vlog. This one finally shed out. And I think that this one actually is a fire GHI lesser. At first I just thought GHI lesser, but then I was like, man, this thing is just so blush and so bright. So I think it's a fire GHI lesser. I have sex them all. This one's a female. Um, the So the lesser fire Woma is a male and the lesser Woma is a male. The GHI Woma is a female. That GHI, which I'm starting to think maybe it's a fire GHI. I'm just not sure why it's so dark. Um, is a female. The normal or possible chocolate in that clutch was a, was a female. And uh, this is from the next clutch. And this is the gem from the clutch. This is a female pied that is, um, let me get her out, 50% pos het clown. This one's dad is 100% double het clown pied. So I figured I'd show her off. Fortunately, there was another pied in this clutch, but it came out of a boo bag. It was really tiny, and it did not make it. All right, so I just want to show off some of the other things that are uh, soon going to be on Morph Market. Um, corn snakes. As you can see here, I have a hypo, I have a normal, and I have an, a melanistic. Um, I just want to show those off. They all, all ate their first meal. Uh, I post them once they've eaten three meals. I just wanted to show off some of the other stuff that we have that is uh, soon to be posted on the morph market. So this here is a, is a cool little snake that just shed out. This is a mystic clown. Ooh, don't bite me. A mystic clown. It's a female. I am going to hold this girl back. Uh, I got a lot of cool things that I can put there in the future. Black pastel, pastel clown, a pastel lesser clown. Just a lot of cool stuff I can do with her in the future. Maybe do a Mystic Heck Clown back to her. Super Mystic Clown. I don't know. All sorts of cool stuff. Um, so I just wanted to show her off. Alright, she was the last of the really cool snakes that shed out uh, for this week's weekly vlog. The size on this girl is amazing. I love the blushing down the back. Alright guys, so this is weekly vlog 2, uh, I'm ending it here showing off another one of my kind of interesting snakes, so hopefully she doesn't bite me right now, which is a little silver savu python. So I do have some cool stuff that I don't always show off, don't bite me, I don't always show off, I think she's going to bite me. Um, this is another cool snake, uh, savu python as I mentioned that I have that I've actually rarely shown off. So just a couple things I want to say is, um, you know, I want to keep doing this weekly vlog thing I would love to get more comments about things people want to see in my collection people want to know how I do stuff people want to know um, what else I got see other animals I have anything like that that's what I want to see in the comments below um, let me know what you guys want to know you know and let me know what you want to see um, and uh, I'm gonna end it here Osmond Reptiles out